times a week tuesday thursday saturday and sunday i do mostly synthetic wig related content here we are multicultural we are inclusive so if you haven't subscribed please do so and if you have you're one of my little doll babies hi doll baby how are you so happy that you are here so today we have a little wig review and this beautiful girl is lane pretty sure it's lane Lane from Renee of Paris. Before we get started with Lane on my eyes and my lips, uh, today I am using the Afrique palette from Juvia's. I love Juvia's. The quality is amazing and like the color stories are great. The quality is amazing. The price is amazing. Um, I got a bunch of Juvia's Place palettes on sale they have really great sales so I scooped up a bunch um this is the Afrique palette today I am wearing these two colors here I'm sorry this color here these two here this and this I'm sorry and this two on my eyes uh this is the look I came up with also wearing a Juvia's Place matte lipstick the packaging is so luxurious it's like this like sort of soft touch matte this is the color Libra and that's the shade that I'm wearing on my lips. It smells so good. So that is what we have for that. Let's get to this girl. This wig is from Renee Paris. It comes in this box. Okay, Kit Kat has a stink bug. So there's a huge situation happening down here. Um, in the box, there was this information and a uh, wig cap. I got it from wigs.com, so it's like their information book. And I got it for, from wigs.com for $113.99 with 30% off. And I have her in the color Mocha Chino. Let's talk about her. Welcome to Coffee Talk with your host, Linda Richmond. This is a full cap wig. I have clips of me getting her together. The one thing, I love the color. I do absolutely love the color. I thought it would be a little bit darker, so that is the only thing about that. It does have some primities. I think that the density is really great, especially if you want, you know, if you have non-textured hair, this would mimic it very well because it is sort of thinner. It's given me like, you know, Jennifer Aniston situation. No, no which I absolutely love. There is some primities. I'm not crazy about how it looks. I think if it was darker, it wouldn't look um, as noticeable. It's noticeable to me. I know to other people it isn't noticeable, but she was a tiny bit shiny, so I did go ahead and put some dry shampoo in her. I think that it has toned her down quite a bit. Bic. Oh, quite a bit. Wig cap is very comfortable. Um, I would say it's an average wig cap. It's not overly large, but... These name brand wigs do come in different size wig caps, so you can get them. Let's look at her from the big. She's probably in that 14-ish, 16-inch range. Very manageable range. Yeah, um, you can make her like a little bit bigger here. I can feel the permatease there. You can also take permatease down. This is a non-heat safe wig, but you can use a like a garment steamer. I'm going to be doing a, a video on that soon. But overall, I love the style. I think if she was slightly darker, I would probably feel a little differently because I just wouldn't notice the permatease as much. But some people like permatease. I just don't. So the fact that I can see it quite a bit in my eyes, but I do feel like it makes sense with the shape. So um, if you don't mind permatease, I think this would be a great one 
for that. I do think that this is definitely a great, you know, it's, it's non-textured hair, you know, so if you're looking for something that's going to mimic, mimic your, you know, natural non-textured hair, I think this would be a great one. I do like the sort of tousled sexy things that you could do with it. Um, you could definitely clip it as well. Um, and bring some of this down and just sort of clip it out of your way. I do like that about it a lot, actually. I'm gonna go ahead and do that. So I'm just gonna clip this, especially for the next video, because you know I don't like bangs in my face. That's the only thing, this is like, I love the style, but the bangs are slightly in my face. I don't jazz with bangs in my face. But I'm gonna go ahead and just clip this sort of back out of my face which I, I like. I like this sort of like real easy, easy style. Yeah, I, I like this wig. Kit Kat! Um, me personally, if I was gonna keep this and wear it, I would just want it slightly darker. I love this shade. It is a sort of cooler toned light brown, which I love. I think the thing is, is like they have this mochaccino and then they have the mochaccino color rooted and I think that would make all the difference because it's it's not super dark root. But I think it would give enough dimension at that um, part for me personally to feel a little bit more comfortable. So that is what I have for Lane. If you have this wig and you have it in another color, go ahead and put that down below and let me know what you think. If there is another wig from Renee Paris that you are interested in me reviewing, go ahead and put that down below. Um, I will include my name brand wig playlist down below as well and if you have subscribed please do so if you have thanks so much i'll see you in my next video bye Right from the sea